Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So, I haven't really gone over my, like, new journey, like, stats or whatever. So, that's what I'm going to be going over today. These stats are annoying anyway. So, here are the tiers. We got all the characters in the game, including Selene. You guys are going to know my opinions. I have the new journey trouble over here to explain some things, because... We're going to go into depth. So these are in the order. I, I honestly don't know. Okay, anyway. Okay. First we got Vision. Now, Vision... Should I even talk or should I just put him in his tier? Listen, he's good as a free character, but like, you know... His moves are good, and he can phase through, but in a real fight, he's nothing. Any character could easily come. D tier. Actually, should we put him? No, D. Because he. Okay, White Vision, we'll put on top because White Vision has a little bit of a buff. Jean. Okay, so she can use Hilkinesis. She can pick people up. She can put them to sleep. She can do her outbursts. She is good at killing people. Um, I'm gonna put her in around B tier because, like, she can be like use. Should I put her in C? Like, she's good ish. Okay, next we got the limited Phoenix Force. I've literally never played as her, I don't really know. How I'm supposed to judge her. So let's look here. Jean Grey Phoenix Force. She has disintegration. I know she has Phoenix Rage. She has Telekinesis, Firebolt, Fire Shock Wave. And she has Resurrection. Phoenix Judgment. I honestly haven't played as her, but I know she is good because my friends have her. I did play her one time, but it was not long. It was a long time ago. And she, like, like, month after she came out but like she she's good she's really good I have been like I'm gonna put her in S tier she's really good okay Dark Phoenix I have played I've played every limited except Jean Grey so I know okay she has her meteors of course she has her little bolts which is her spell uh, she has a really good combo, which is her outburst, and then the bolts, and then disintegrate. They're dead instantly. But, like, she she has her meteors as well. She has her ultimate. She has a resurrection. But the downside to her resurrection is she can only get it once every 20 minutes, which is kind of annoying um, compared to other characters that get it every life. She's really good. She has two outbursts. One of them, she only uses the quick one. I haven't seen someone use the like the long one that rages up in so long because it takes forever. And by the time it, you ramp up to use the ability, they're going to put on their shield. So no one uses it. Okay, we're going to put her. I, is she better than Phoenix Force? No. So we're, okay, well, yeah, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I, okay, this is supposed to be, okay, I think she's better. I haven't played Phoenix Force. I don't know. She could be God tier, but I just haven't played her. Okay, Agatha. Silence. Um, I do kill people with Agatha, but I kill people with the Salem. So the regular doesn't, okay, so... The runes, the cuffs are good. There's and the bolts are like the only thing they use. The ag the regular Agatha is kind of outdated. No one uses her anymore. They they use Salem. I'm gonna put her in B tier above Jean because Jean, Agatha can use go. Okay. Um. Since she has the repulse, I'm putting Agatha in A tier. She can kill. She could kill Celine easily if she wanted to. Like, she's really good. 
not saying anything about Celine. Celine's really good. We're gonna get to her later. Next we got Endgame. She has her throw, like her telekinesis, and then she has her bolt, like her explosion bolt. And she has the pickup, and she has like her. No one uses the rocks anymore um, for a combo because by the time the, it's such a long animation that by the time like they get up, you're just gonna they're just gonna use her shield. Really good. I have killed so many people with Endgame. She was my first main, so I'm gonna put her in A tier in front of. Or should I put her here? Yeah, let's put her B tier. Next we got the Wanda Wardrobe Game Pass, which is, uh, where is it, looks, no these, bro I can't, I don't think she, oh where is she, here, yeah, so like, she's, she's good, really good, honestly, Scarlet Witch should have been unlimited, and Wardrobe should have been an accessory but anyway okay wardrobe is really good shido has the same things as as her just she has an instant kill um she can transform into her at 30 percent health should be like 50 percent, but not complain not complaining at least she can like try because like if someone messes up their combo and she's low enough she can just turn into scarlet witch and then she gets i believe well, it, I'm not gonna say anything. But like she can like if once she's Scarlet Witch, she can like kill people. So like the base, but like not so so without the instinct kill. Put her here. Should I put her here? Okay, let's put her here. With the instinct kill. Okay, so her hex is really good. So should I put her here? And then move her up. There. Yeah. Next we have mom. No self explanatory. It's really self explanatory. Um, she has she has her auto shield, she has dream walking, she has the ability to make people not use their abilities, she has the monster, she has the dark hold. There's literally so many things she has. I wish I bought her. I was literally playing New Journey at the time. But when they released her. I didn't know she was going to be limited. It said limited, but I thought it was just going to be another one of those games that says they're limited and then brings them back. <coughs> you, you, no, no. Heroes. Heroes just brings back the limiteds. Uh, and they say they're limited and they're not because they bring them back. I thought that's what New Journey. New Journey actually keeps them limited. Um... Yeah, and they make a ton of money off it. Like, Celine, um, Celine, t over 10,000 people bought her. Yeah. So, they're making lots. Anyway, Mom's really good. Should have bought her. Couldn't. Monica, um, she's better than Vision. Okay, next we got Storm, the base. She has her ice. She has, yeah, she can like stop you from moving. She has her, I don't know, I barely play the base because I always play, if I do play her, I play Goddess. Let's put her here. Okay, and then for Bloodstorm, she has a bit of a buff. We'll put her here. In front of Agatha. Agatha's like, meh. Okay, and then we got Goddess Storm. She's really good. She has the lightning. She has the tornadoes. She has, like, the disintegration. 20, 25% is so low, it shouldn't even be considered an instant kill, because it just doesn't make sense, because, like, it's not really an instant kill if they're 25%. So, like, honestly, I think 
got a storm, she got another skin. I know she got, she literally got Bloodstorm, but Bloodstorm was just a reskin and re like particles. I think they should release another one. Because we also, they should release another one that has a couple more abilities. You know. These ads are so annoying. Okay. There. Anyway, now we got Winter Storm. Basically the same as base, but she has, uh, like, a choke ability. And she has her Storm. Her Storm, oh my god. S tier. She's very good. The Storm and this together instant kill everyone on the map, including Mom. They all die easily. Anyway, really good, really good, really good, really good. Wish I got her. Oh my god, th this is another with situations that I wish I got her and I didn't because I was playing at the time, but I didn't, but I didn't have coins or Robux. Anyway, I'm missing out on so much great stuff. Anyway. Invisible Woman, she could kill basically anyone with her combo. Let's put her in, like, here, because, like, she better, yeah. Yeah, her combo, like, choking people, can't. they can't use their abilities. Okay. I have no words for this Audrey. We're going to put her there vision down Audrey what are you doing the, we're not talking about the shadow fairy shadow fairy is good like shadow fairy could go here she's good okay and then we got tinkerbell over here fairy fantasy whatever uh she's basically the same but she has the wand that like shoots bolts and she has a bit of buff. I'm gonna put her. Uh, she is good. I can really eat up like three people at the same time with her. B. Okay. Next we got regular Quicksilver. Both Quicksilvers deserve equal t equality. They're all. Okay, first of all, I can't really say anything because I sometimes get eaten up by Quicksilvers when it's like late at night, which it is right now. If, like, when it's late at night and, like, like, my hands are so tired or, like, I don't know. I just, like, lose to a Quicksilver. Like, they out-spam me. Anyway, I'm, uh, I don't see an Emma dark skin, but they're literally the same anyway. Okay, Emma, she can force people onto astral plane. She can also take away memories, but that's a different, but it's literally two, but well, hmm, skill point. I think the skill point one's better. Uh, just the fact she can literally kill someone with one ability and punch is really good. And she can also put to people to sleep from far range, which makes up from the fact she can't fly. She can literally put someone to sleep midair, like if they're flying above her. Uh, and when she first came out, everyone, like, people still main her. She's really good. A tier. Quake, she has the earthquake. She also has the mass earthquake, which is, like, a whole server, but unfortunately, only, like, five people in the whole world have it. Thanks, New Journey, because they literally said it's a giveaway exclusive. And they hosted one giveaway. Or I think it was two. But they literally have... They're literally gatekeeping this ability so much. And I understand Mass Earthquake, if too many people have it, it's going to be annoying. But look at Winter Storm. Like, 5,000 people have her. She Her, ulti, her like, storm is, like, used, like, every five minutes, like, the cooldown. It's, like, it's not, like... I don't know. And it does a lot of damage. Uh, some, like, one of my friends has it and they did it. Oh my god. Ugh. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna not even talk about the mass earthquake because it's literally so rare. 
it's not even worth talking about so i'm not gonna grade her on that i'm gonna grade her on like she can choke people she also has 75 instant kill she is the first character in the game to have 75 percent instant kill which makes her big advantage i'm gonna put her a tier just behind even though she eats up anyway human torch he has the dark phoenix um fake meteors he has the like the swirl for the fire he has the pushback which does have like a little long animation but it's fine um i'm just thinking because like i don't know let's put him like everyone he's never taken anymore I remember the days when everyone was take when he was taken the first day and then the next day he was never taken you can go into a full server and one person like he would never be taken that's cause people realize off the bat that he's weak anyway he's still weak but people still like trying to play him anyway he's really weak okay we're one, one last character before Celine cause let's this guy, this guy was the last one to come out about Forest only in anyway. Iceman, Iceman, Iceman. He can make his clones. He has his ultimate, which is the big, like, four-step thing. And make, he stomps his foot. Ice goes around. He has the thing. Like, oh, my God. S tier. He's good. For the time, everyone's waiting. Okay. Celine, when, when everyone was teasing her, like... She came out yesterday. Well, so this video will probably be out. We'll look at the time right now. It'll probably be out like today. So, like, when she came out, like, I, I mentioned the story on, in the showcase that I, I was literally about to go film a video about Celine, like, when she's going to come out and stuff, and, like, what my predictions are for when she's coming out. Because they changed everything. They changed all the banners. They changed the game passes, everything. So then, wh right when I go to record it, she comes out, and my f and my friends are like screaming over the phone that she's coming out, that she came out. Anyway, at, within two minutes of her coming out, I bought her, went and uh, rushed my friends into a private server, did a showcase rushed me into it like I, I was really speed running that day i got those videos out i was speed running oh my god i was terrified to like get those videos out anyway so so me she has her ultimate honestly i don't like her first and uh, her first and second ew but her last one is I, I love the skin I wish she started out with the blue and went to red because the blue is so much better um 80% of someone's health being taken is really good the only pack the only thing I don't like about her you have to kill like four people to unlock last ultimate no it's actually five because the first one's one person the second one's two people and the third one is like Another two people. Oh, it's a five. Like, it's yet to... Yeah. Okay. Um, people are going to give me some hate about this, but I have already come to the truth that Celine is not that good. I've come to the truth that I've been playing her. She's not that good. Now, before you start, like, screaming, sh she is decent because she has her ultimate. She has her lift up thing she has her storm a really good combo you do her storm and the swirl thing a really good combo you can get them down to like the point where you can instant kill him another good one is you could do the storm and the like hold prison thing she has good combos the problem is is that she can easily be killed and i know she has two like self resurrections but It's just like you can't with that thirty seconds of immortality. You can't kill anyone because people actually get scared of that immortality and they run away like little chickens. And then the second that thirty seconds is up, they're eating you up again. Like, I I understand it's a PvP game. You like have to protect yourself, but like, it's like 
ghetto. Like, just fight. Like, you run away acting scared, and then you come back and try and up. Anyway, so Celine is, she's decent. She can easily be killed by another combo, by another person. If you, if you fail her combo, uh, it's hard because it's uh, her, actually it's hard to fail her combo because the second you, like the second that bolt goes into the air, not even before it starts, they can't use their abilities. It's basically an ability stopper. So like, even that, and it's like a, the storm is like a 20 second cooldown. Oh my god. I love that ability. They're probably going to nerf it to like a minute. Ugh. I, I hope they don't. But they probably will because it's like balanced or whatever. Huh. Anyway, she, good combos, good potential, but she's not better than Mom or Phoenix or Phoenix Force. She's just not. She's good, but she's not that great. Uh, people would give me hate if I said that she was what that storm was better than her she she is good i'm not trying to hate on her she is good she she's good she's good combos and everything but compared to other people she's not she she was not the she was not the limited i was expecting i was expecting a powerful character that could take down anyone i had high hopes that something could kill mom and drain her shield easily but that's not what happened she ended up being a, a dis disappointment for me and jj if you're if you're listening to this no hate she's a great character great combos great everything but for a limited and i've actually i've been talking to other people in the server like i've talked to like at least 50 people by now we all agree that for a limited for the last ever limited in your game we were expecting more than just like two area abilities and like that like we were ex it's a great character but we were expecting more we were expecting more anyways this is the final tier list i know i just talked about slain for like five minutes but i it's like everyone wants to talk about her like i have to talk about her all right anyway um thank you guys for watching more Celine videos coming out i think i'm already tired of Celine. <laughs> march 7th i'm already tired of her uh, she's a good character but she gotta have some potential she needs a buff even though she's already good one slot she needs two slots but whatever okay this is finished tier list have a good day guys join my discord join my discord i need to promote my discord more okay thank you guys for watching goodbye